Anduin versus Gul'dan. Mm, or luck. Your soul shall be mine. The light shall bring victory. Hopefully not handlock. I'm a little bit afraid of a handlock matchup. Now I go first, so I can't actually check on it. Uh, because it might be worth playing the cleric. But even if it's Zoo, he kept two cards. He could has some the coin also, so he might play Void Walker, which would be good for me. But he could also play Knife Juggler or um, Flame Imp. And then my Cleric dies for free because I can't back it up with a uh, Power Shield or something. Uh, I guess this one a Cleric would have been nice though. I guess I still play it. Now I at least get rid of this. If he doesn't, I don't know, play... Um, what's it called? Shattered Sun Cleric. I haven't seen this in ages, but would be a good turn for him to play it. <laughs> so many My next turn is Death Lord, anyways, so it hopefully helps. Why do you fall? Ah, that's an owl. Okay. I think I don't want to hit here. Turn 4. It's a little bit different because I can set up for Holy Nova, but I can still set up for Holy Nova, so... Um, he has 5 damage, so he would need something like a Parallel Whelming, basically. Or like, Double Abusive. I'll probably like Double Trade next turn. If, if the board stays, stays somewhat the same, it's like Trade, Trade, Heal. Or maybe just play the second Death Lord. So many Set up for a Holy Nova. Depends a little bit on what he does, of course. Hmm. Ah, looks like Power Word Shield Death Lord. Alright. Next turn I can pretty much clear and heal my stuff back up. Even if he Arguses. As for now he has 6 damage on the board, so he could get rid of one Death Lord. If he has something like Abuse it. Okay. Interesting enough. I wonder what I really want to do here. It's interesting. I could play just the next taunt. Or I could double trade into the Imp Gang boss and Holy Nova. I must consider. Or I could single trade hit this and hit this and Holy Nova. Probably has a Doomguard. Or he might have a Doomguard. Put it this way. Doomguard doesn't even die to some of these cards. Um I must consider. But also just like trade, trade, heal, thought steal. Quickly. Well, let's do it this way. It's like the cleanest kill I can come up with at the moment. I don't need to give his um, demon charge at the moment, which is the worst side. Uh, okay. yeah. The other side is he could have like prepared to get wow to get this guaranteed. Well, I guess that's a good life bomb now. That's why it's in the deck, right? To kill a seven seven, a nine seven, and a five four, and to hit this for two. <laughs> That's why it's in the deck twice, I should say. Uh, I could steal a 4 attack minion in two turns. Implosion? Okay.
Almost if I steal the egg, he can get through this. Looks like a Holy Nova could be nice here. 4 against my... Or a 4-2 against my... 2-8 if I heal it up back again. I could also just play these two. Just leave it there. A lot of possible options here. I think I go with the with the clean clear here though. There are a lot of shenanigans I can do later. Like these two. To steal this, for example, if I want to. Or this. My shield for Argus! Not this one more. Um. Hmm. Play this also. I'm not entirely sure what is the best option here. I will go with this one for the moment. And in Zoo, there are a lot of good Cabal targets, anyways. And he didn't play a single abusive yet, for example. Oh, he plays Shredders. But I might just get the two drop of this, I guess. It's nine. Fits quite well, huh? Let's see what we draw. I guess I'd choose a 2-2 two, two over 2-1. Two, I could also pick the 2-1 because I can heal it, but I'm likely to heal the Death Lord, right? Let me change your mind. I just want to create an overwhelming board presence here. He will tap his self to die. Uh, my only problem is Dr. Boom because I still have two Shadow Word Deaths in the deck. He doesn't play it for now. And it will draw a bunch of cards. Uh, so many good. Oh wow. This would have been great. Okay. Didn't need it. I think this time I played the deck how it's really supposed to work. There were a lot of decisions uh, that could have been different. But I think overall I chose the right paths. But I'm thinking about um, changing the recombobulator to a second string meister. The combo potential is just too fun. Let's try it this way. Um, okay, I hope it's Zoo again, I guess. Um, this can be played turn three, I guess. We'll see. Okay, otherwise, if it's Handlock, I'd probably coin out the Death Lord and play the Chosen on it to try something like beating him down. I would really like him to be Zoo, though. Like, he mulligan all cards, and he taps turn two, but he thought a lot about it. So maybe, just maybe, he didn't get too many great cards and has something like a knife juggler that he doesn't uh, want to sacrifice into my zombie chow. I hope it's this, and not handlock. But we'll find it out. Other option would have been, like, power shield to draw more cards, but... In case of handlock, I feel like I want to deal a little, like, put up at least a little bit of pressure. Okay, becomes more likely. I'm putting this on this because that's the better silence target, like the worst silence, uh, the worst silence target because he doesn't want to silence it because it gets a random minion, but uh, it's also a 412. 
Where's my Paul Wood? Uh, Shadow Wood? Oh, whatever. Um, I might also just recombobulate it if it gets hit too much. To the throw. Actually, a Shadow Flame is a little bit annoying here. Couldn't really play around it though. Can heal this for 4 next turn, which puts it exactly to 16, so 2 hits will do the trick. I wonder. Let's see if he has Molten's. <laughs> Yeah, Shadow Flame. Wow. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, I'm dead. Yeah, there's nothing I can really do. Other than maybe power shield and hope for the 2 and 21. No. Oh. Well, I couldn't play this anyways. Maybe he plays like... I don't know. A big thing that I can just light bomb away. Oh wow. Two discounts. Um, yeah. Great job, Deathlord. But I was aware that the handlock matchup is bad anyways with this deck, so... It's not a big surprise. Maybe Sylvanas and Light Bomb can do some stuff, but I doubt it. Hit a discount on 8 cards. Gets another one this turn. He's just overwhelmed by all the cheap mana options he has in his hand. Can imagine. I have no time for games. I wonder if this is big enough for a light bomb. It might not be. <laughs> However, I have to get rid of this rain, so maybe just something like this. Only Nova hit means this is a 3 4. So I can't I can sacrifice it, but then nothing happens. It's probably better than death. <laughs> oh, wrong order. Oops. I wanted to do it in exactly the other order. Ah. I'm, do I'm doing silly things. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm not sure what just happened. It's probably like arena... Arena mentality to first do this and then heal it back up, but I explicitly didn't want to heal it up, but somehow forgot about that for a second. My shield for Argus. It's probably the best light bomb I can get so far. But I'm kind of out of cards, and he still has his 9 cards, 2 discounts, and as many taps as he wants. There's a Jaraxxus also, I don't see myself winning this. Maybe with a lucky Sylvanas, but I really don't. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe face. Face would be good. Of course not. Could've traded. Then maybe do something. No, no. I have no time for games. We'll probably just get silenced. Strong a lot, uh, enough cards to have an owl by now. So many possibilities. Off the top. Could have played it in other order. Hmm. 
Well, I guess I want a second light bomb then. There's really a Combobula that it could also be a BGH, I suppose. It'd be quite fun. This doesn't really help, huh? Uh, to its defense, if it was shrink mice, that wouldn't have helped anyways. Could get the Twilight Drake if I get a Cabal. Just play your stupid cards, man. It's not like it would be hard by now. Of course the minion again, Rack. Of course. 16 That's an improvement Is someone injured? Could have drawn cards with it, but I doubt that it will be the case so. It's probably lethal anyways Just need something like a hellfire Well, there were a lot of things that didn't go my well away here. First, a mountain giant turn four, instead of something more tame like a twilight drake. Second, I didn't have uh, any of my clears, like no shadow or death, no shadow or uh, no light bomb, nothing to deal with it. Uh, and then I didn't get... And then he got Emperor Thorson. And then the rag hit three times the perfect target. So. I wouldn't have won regardless of the rack hits, of course, but still. Anduin versus Alleria. Tremble before the might of the hour. The light shall bring victory. Against Hunter, I'm looking for all my early game. I'm not sure if I should have kept the Shrinkmeister though. To like trade a zombie chow for free. Uh, this ooze will be useful later, but the rest of the oh boy, the rest of the hand is pretty much garbage. Okay, this might help at some point, at some time. But I have a heal bot, I have a holy nova, so I can actually make up for a slow start, I suppose. What? Huh? <laughs> He's like, okay, we'll quick shot it. Oh, why doesn't it work? That's weird. <laughs> Let's just do this. I can always find a Shadow Man as target, and if he does something like left Zuka now, or quick shot, then I've then I can use the ooze and I have things out of the way. Yeah. I knew it was a quick shot. That's three damage out of the way, that's pretty okay, I guess. I have Shadow Madness for the next turn to run this into something that he might play, like in a King Golem or Wolf Rider. Ah, oh, there's the Glyph Suka. Okay. It's uh, Ooze then. Ooze and heal. Then I have Holy Nova to deal with stuff. Oh, I guess I can throw down this. I have the Heal Bard and two Holy Novas. I think I don't have to care too much about my health total right now. And the second I draw a Death Lord should be alright anyways. Abusive? Get in there, oh, okay. fight, what else would he have targeted here? Let's see what trap it is. Probably explosive. Yeah. Sure. The ooze would have died anyway, so no real need to Holy Nova. Is 
set this up before he comes up with an with a bow or something. Attacking with a lower attack minion in case of random misdirection. Actually, Holy Nova seems pretty decent here, given that I have a second one. Protects my stuff from Unleash. Otherwise I would have thought Steel... Put this apple on your head. Heal. Okay, second Glyph Zucker. That's a little bit annoying. But I can trade my Zombie Chow. Death Lord looks pretty decent, but I think I prefer Senjin in this situation. Simply because it costs more mana and I want to heal myself. And I can't play these two together. It's like a s easy turn. Without the heal bot I would be at 10 the whole time. But now I have a few taunts to protect me. More or less. Ah, there we go. I think second Holy Nova is alright here, right? No need to use Shadow Manners, I think. It's almost out of steam. Although I would like to get a heal in every turn plus the Holy Nova because this doesn't do anything about my health total right now. So maybe it's Shadow Madness, Death Lord. Yeah, this looks better. Because if we regard it over a course of like two turns, then I get in two health, health now, two, two health the next turn, plus two health the next turn. So I get like... I get two health more on the long run. And health is like all that matters right now. Nothing else matters really. If he runs a second owl, has it for this? Okay. Unleash, probably. Oh, Wolf Rider. Okay. He loses everything to this. That's good. Let's see what he gets. Creeper would be nice. Okay. I take it. Let me change your mind. I really don't want him to get unleashed though. To get rid of my stuff actually. Um how much damage do I have? Six, eight. Eight uh eleven plus three fourteen. Now I want to heal myself, otherwise I would probably thought steal and see if I can kill him somehow. I want to get rid of this because of Unleash. <laughs> means one less Hound, means one less damage to my face. I don't really care about... Like, uh, on the long run I kill him anyway, so... Masterful. I can see. Masterful. That's why I'm running this deck. Not because of some random handlock. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Not a freeze. I might just keep this. Turn 3 I can like trade the zombie chow into something. Shrinkmeister. I don't know. I don't really know, but I'll keep it. <laughs> Had to open a glass for my wife. I'm strong! That's what I talked about. Ah, uh, no, not really. I can't shrink my heal turn three. Hmm. 
Uh, four. However. Yeah, I'm still not doing it right. I should have just played the ooze last turn. Because the you can win this matchup probably by two win conditions. The first is to draw more cards than your opponent. The second one is to let him draw, draw more cards and win by fatigue. I think that's like the two options. And I just threw away one of my win conditions stand ready. with a Snarshy Cleric. Five damage there, but seems like I need six. That's that's sad. Problem is that he will get the buff to something else, but at least I have a board, and I don't have to be afraid of holding over because he co just coined. He cannot do it this turn, and he won't be able to do it next turn either. So I can keep my stuffer alive for a few turns. I shouldn't have played the cleric, I, I really shouldn't have. Oh, that's getting really annoying. Uh-huh, okay. Well, I, I guess that's a clean Holy Nova, huh? Sension is on the upper side of things, I suppose. This is 5 against my 5, basically, so we are kinda even. I want this pyro. Probably won't get it though, if he doesn't play any more stuff here. Can get a zombie chow. Definitely don't want to recombobulate Mount Sylvanas. Ah, oh, Power Shield of Valence Chosen would have been really nice here. I guess I take the Zombie Chow. It's the best I can get. I wonder. Or is it? I could heal this thing. That's a fun idea. Then he just trades it into Lothab if I play it. Then it's a 5-1, then he doesn't play anything. No, I think I just take the zombie chow. Let none survive. It's still like one card for like three cards because that's Pyro, Valance and this. Then I play this. And pass. Now imagine I still had the Cleric and I could just throw it down after injuring these two and playing Holy Nova or something. Would have been a lot of a help here. Can't really do anything. It's like he's taken a different approach on this anti-aggro thing. Oh yeah. Fault steal, fault steal, please. Oh, he has another Shadow Award pain. Wow, these are the probably one of the weakest cards I could have gotten. Not even sure if I want to play it. Well, I kinda have to do something, huh? 
Maybe I should just drop the heal bar. It doesn't do anything anyways. These at least don't die to light bomb. Maybe he should just play heal bot recombobulator. But he probably plays light bomb too if he plays death lords. Hmm. It's hard to tell. I didn't get any of my good cards, I feel like. Well, Thought Steel was a good card, but I didn't get good cards of it. Oh no! Does he deal 5 damage to me? Oh no, so cruel. <laughs> I guess I might just... Uh, maybe I just Holy Nova. It's almost out of cards. Yeah, now imagine the, the cleric, I could like Holy Nova heal, get a bunch of stuff. Hmm, it's so sad. I wonder. Elon's Chosen puts it out of range of all, um, all Shadow Word spells. Used one pain, no deaths so far. Is someone injured? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. But I got this. So I'm really regretting that I played this cleric. <laughs> Turn two. Okay, now a better one please. Got the same shadow word again. Well, this qualifies, I guess. I guess I just hope that he doesn't run um, Shrinkmeister Cabal himself. I'm pretty sure he runs Cabal, but I'm not sure about the Shrinkmeister. Well played. Second Holy Fire? No. In the light's name. <laughs> okay, I somehow won this. Nice. 